Perry, where are we off to? We are headed to Greece. Basically, we're going on a huge girls trip to Greece today. So it's me, Perry, and Blaine, and then four of our friends from Hawaii. So seven of our Hawaii girls group all meeting in Greece. We're doing Santorini and Eos and just kind of like bouncing around. We're on the train now from Florence to Rome. And then once we get to Rome, we're gonna go to the airport and fly from Rome to Santorini. Successfully made it to our train transfer. We were running, but we did it. We had literally one minute to get me <laughs> try it. it. So our train was delayed. I was, I felt like we were gonna make it for sure, but this is a different train. It's pretty fast though. Yeah. Now on to the airport. All right, we've made it through security in Rome. Headed to our gate. Gen C, Blaine, Perry, who we've been with the whole time. <laughs> Squad's coming together. Look who it is. Reunion Cheers. Begins. The reunion begins. Waiting for our flight to Santorini. <laughs> we made it. <laughs> Woo! What time is it? It's at two o'clock in the morning. So long, bye. And we're here. <laughs> This is our hotel. It's giving um, Girl Scouts. It's giving camp. It's giving sofas here. This is our hotel, and it's kind of like a hostel, <laughs> no, but it is a hostel. It, okay, it's, it's a, a it's no. A hostel. It's a hotel, but this room in particular is what they call their basement bunk oh, room, and it has eight beds. So it's basically like a hostel <laughs> bed. And it was a trek to find, but we're here. So now I think we're gonna go to sleep for the night. At least I am. Greece day one. So, hey y'all. Hey y'all, it's our first day in Greece, y'all. <laughs> Good morning, Good morning, everybody. We look bougie enough. Everyone looks day. so cute. <laughs> oh, did you know? I didn't get any food. Mm, breakfast. <laughs> first meal. I feel so bad. I feel so bad. Coming live from the, what would you call this? Bunk room? room? The bunk room? Everyone's getting some crimped hair. We are getting ready to go to Fira. I have this romper on um, from Hemline in Oxford. Here's Kasha's fit. Beautiful. Where's your dress from, Kash? Beautiful. I know. Perry? Um, I guess it's from Zara. Right in May. They're good. Yeah. And your face is from my face is from my your, mom and dad. Your parents. <laughs> so. Okay, this was my mom's. That's so cute. She was just having a look at the shoes. Sheen. Yeah, yeah. So I just put the necklace. Get back necklaces. That's cute. You look so beautiful. Get ready for our activity of the day. Let's go see some stuff. Yes. All right, heading to the bus stop. Content time. Yeah, um, I'm gonna need a shot down there. Content one time. Done. Beautiful. I'm getting in queue for that. <laughs> drink, drink. A beverage. Whoa, look at here. Can we still all sit on that couch? Yeah, we could go down there. That'd be perfect. But it's not shaded, so I don't know. We could definitely go down there. Oh, see the vibes. This is called nectar. Take your menu. Take your menu. Having a little drink now that we've made it to Fira. I feel like Fira, where we are right now, is like very traditional, like what you think of when you think of Greece the white buildings on the cliffside. And then in a little bit today, we're gonna go to Oya, which is the blue domes. But it's actually crazy because in Greece, there's not like tons of blue domes. It's, it's like 
a couple, but you think it's like every single place. It helps that I was just here, so I was able to kind of like know where we were a little bit, get a drink, continue on with our day. Cheers to, oh my God. First day, first full day. And the others for Prosecco, the fruit. Thank you so much. Amazing. Gelato break. Sprinkles. In Fira, watching the sunset, it was a noble quest. I know how we mean it. We're in, we're in, I mean, sorry. Where are we? Oya. 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 I stand corrected. Oya. Oya. We're not there. Also, guys, just for a little bit of Bachelor Nation history, do you guys know Hannah Brown and Peter Weber in this windmill? Yeah. National landmark. We lost the other four, but the Florence squad is together. Florence forever. Our dinner spot with my little ladies waiting for the rest of the group. I feel like I'm about to get a massage. Everyone, everyone who works here is nice and attractive. <laughs> if you guys are wondering, this is the restaurant. Alexis, uh, our dinner spot. We, we should show them in. And it's perfect. I'll show you the men. Perry will vlog the men. Here you go. Let's talk about sunset. Can you tell me your sunset experience? Sunset was similar to the Serengeti. <laughs> <laughs> At Life first, death. the sun was shining through the windmill. It was beautiful. It was radiant. It was a work of Mother Nature. But then the wildebeest Blaine, came. Blaine paints a picture. The wildebeest came. They started migrating. It was, it was crazy. There was no hope for anyone. It was like Noah's Ark. They were just Noah's flooding. Ark, yeah, there That's was a good like, description. That was how the sunset was. The great migration ensued. The wild after the buffalo sunset. migration. And we're lucky to find this place because we are ready for a drink. The best gelato. The best dessert in general. The best gelato we've had since we moved to Europe. Oh my god, focus. Oh yeah, take a bite. Yeah. <laughs> It's so good. There's it's this place in Santorini. Oh my god. Amazing. 10 out of 10. Breakfast with Gen Z. Perry. Last morning in Santorini before we head to the ferry to go to Eos today. So I'm really excited. Getting on our ferry to head to Eos. Okay, boarding the ferry in Santorini is giving Noah's Ark energy. Um, mixed with Hunger Games. A little bit. This is our ferry to Greece. While the loading was kind of chaotic. And we all ran and we got next to each other. Yeah, we're all next to each other. Except and it, this is actually one of the nicest ferries I've been on so far. And we're moving. Quick yacht. This man's taking me on yeah. the yacht right here. I said quick yacht, quick ferry. Quick Wish yacht. you were getting loaded on that. Our hotel. Here's our room in Eos. We have the roomies. <laughs> Similar to the place yesterday, but we have two separate rooms, both with four beds. Eating lunch in Eos. And then before we go party, all day and night. We need to make sure we eat a lot. First day in Eos. Let's get after it. Cheers to you guys. Oh, the vlog. Wow, the this vlogger. is my first Aperol Spritz ever. <laughs> Here's my lunch. Chicken Here's Slovakia lunch. game. Where are we, Perry? Give us a little vlog. We're at this club called Far Out. It's a beach club. We're 
a DJ later tonight. All the drinks are like eight euros. Everyone's pretty. Lane's content creating already. Lane's living in her own world. Far out. You're alive. I'm alive and well. No, I mean Slipping. you're alive on the vlog. Oh. <laughs> Day four. Three. Day two of being Eos. Perry, do you want to tell about our night last night? I think the we last went... the last video I have is when the fireworks were shooting off Kasha at the <laughs> at Far Out. I took my vlog camera and they started shooting off fireworks. It was awesome. Um oh my God, that. that was so sick. Please tell me. So we went bar hopping after we went to far out in this little town i don't know the name of and it was oh, really fun Chow. Chow. Chora. 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 we went to Chora. far out it was a beach club and like a I hostel wild. i don't know <laughs> and then we went into the town of whatever it's called and we stayed out until um, I, I stayed out until 5.30. I stayed out until like 3.30. And yeah, we woke up this morning and we did a beach day in front of our hotel because there's a beautiful beach and we ate and now we're just getting ready for our next adventure of the day. And this is our last full day, so make it a good one. <laughs> You're so cute. <laughs> We are getting ready to go out. I washed my hair. Finally, um, I'm wearing this Zara dress. Perry, you want to show your fit? Uh, this dress in Greece. Kind of a, so cute. so cute. But anyways, getting ready tonight. We're gonna go to a club. We're actually gonna eat dinner there. It's called Pathos. Pathos. And all the girls are in here getting ready. And then we're gonna head out. Dinner at the Bulls Club. on the dinner. My dinner was delicious. My favorite part was sharing the rock shrimp with you. Dinner done. Time to club. <laughs> One thing about Europe I will say on my list of grievances is that it takes like 20 years to pay for your dinner. Like they really expect you to have like those European five hour dinners. Like we eat, we're ready to party, and they just like take huh? about an hour to bring the check. We also got dessert on the house. Oh we did, yeah. I, Very I happy about that. Got my favorite creme brulee. <laughs> okay, the check's here now we can actually pay. Heading home, Gen Z. Sad. You want to talk about what we've done today? No. <laughs> okay. Basically, a GN Airlines can get. Um, so this we is Italy Italian Airlines. Let's okay, we'll stop. So our flight from Santorini to Athens, because we had a connection, was delayed extremely, which then resulted in us missing our connection from Athens to Rome. So they rebooked us on, I also, I look crazy right now. They rebooked us on a different flight, 
later, like three hours later, and then that ended up messing up our training home. So, we've hit a couple bumps in the road. I'll be able to explain later, but just say prayers. See you tomorrow. I can't. They just asked us if we were flying to Atlanta. I'm like, no. <laughs> I am like, I swear to God, if you put us on a flight to Atlanta, I would lose my mind. Chaotic travel home update. We've made it to the train station. Our train is at 9.08. It's 8.44. We got here earlier than expected. Oh no, Perry's struggling. Hold it high up. Now she's having to get assistance to get through. Update, Perry can't get in because her ticket's for tomorrow. And I know she's gonna be so pissed because she did this last week and bought the wrong day. And she was so upset about it and she did it again. So I'm gonna wait for her and see. Her ticket, oh, her ticket was free to change. She didn't have to pay. And our train's here, so let's go. Made it home. Shout out to our backyard looking cute. We have officially made it home. 12 hours later, sweating because we turned all of our AC off, but really happy to be home. Successful trip to Greece. Such a fun weekend with the girls, and we have a couple days in between Greece and our next trip to Budapest, so I'm gonna bring this vlog to a close so I can edit it and get it out to you guys, but thank you for watching, and thank you for coming along with us on our girls' trip to Greece. And I'll see you guys all in the next one. Bye.